I don't think I've ever played a draft set with cards as bad as the ones we're about to play with. Dolph. This is, we're, we're in for something special today. This is going to be a little bit weird. Uh, we're playing with AI-generated cards. Mm -hmm. We did this before. It was really funny. It was great, but it took a lot of time. Now, we want to shout out Urza's Artificial Intelligence. Urza's AI. Don't know who made it. They're great. You type in a name of a card, it gives you a card. It generates a card at random. We'll each do 15 tries. Mm -hmm. We'll build a deck with what we have. It's just as easy as this. You put in a name. I'll put in YouTube Subscriber. Mm, type how, how convenient! Yourself. How convenient! <laughs> As this generates the card, just so you know, we put a lot of effort into these videos. It really, really helps us if you click that sub button. It costs you nothing, but in exchange, if you just scroll down a year ago, look at our channel, look at how bad things looked. It does help us when you click subscribe, and you could become a two mana YouTube subscriber. Creature human wizard, when YouTube came into my life, I was one one with the mundane neighbors of the group. I'm not in the one one league with the sins of what? <laughs> oh no, Todd, I hope our cards are not this bad. What is this? Like, <laughs> I don't know. I mean, what is a mundane neighbor of the group? These are not even real rules. Like these are not, this is not what's he canon. Good luck, I would say. Uh, <laughs> let's see how this goes. <laughs> Uh, do you want to go first or do I go first? Um, you can go first. Okay. Reacting is probably pretty strong. I've, I've, I've thought about this long and hard. Yeah. On the meanest, most aggressive card I could come up with. And I could have done some like, Tal is a dum dum, I don't know. But I'm going to make a legendary creature because you have the comma, Tal yeah. Potato Goblin. Okay. It's the most cutting thing I could come up with. Let's try. Tal Potato Goblin. It's a. 2-2 two, two Goblin Rogue, whenever another creature you control dies, if you control another <laughs> Goblin, draw a card! That's actually broken! I'm going Goblin Tribal. Now, yeah, now you have to uh, get more Goblins for this. Yes, and I need, what are good Goblin names? Apparently Tolaf is a good Goblin The art name. is great, look at that. <laughs> yeah, this is fantastic. <laughs> your spin. Okay. So I'm trying to, to put your brakes a little bit. We're gonna do Goblin Extinction. <laughs> No, that was just to see, just to see. Maybe I should have done that last when you put all the goblins. <laughs> and then you do like, yeah, now I don't need to put goblins in my deck. Oh, what's a wrath of goblins, you know? Goblin extinction. Put target creature card from a graveyard onto the battlefield. Under I'm going to reanimate it. Let's go. The apes would worship their master now. Ominous. Wow. Okay, not what I expected. Would it's an off. instant too. Yeah, you better not attack. Now, if you've got creatures in your graveyard, all right. Um, now so you have to build a reanimator. You have to build a reanimator. Yeah. I'm. I think I'm gonna try to build a goblin lord. Okay. Um, War chief, goblin master. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's all the keywords. Yeah. <laughs> if this doesn't give goblins plus one plus one, I, I don't know what does. War chief goblin master becomes a. <laughs> <laughs> That's not it at all! <laughs> you want a goblin? It's a 3 on a 2 2 goblin shaman. That if I tap him and pay one red, he becomes a berserker shaman. You also need to tap him. That's right. <laughs> That's not good. Once the earth has fallen, all manner of beings will be reduced to scrap. There will be no survivors, says Volrath, innkeeper of sleight of hand. I love this. Classic Volrath. <laughs> Classic. <laughs> <laughs> this, this is not as good as I was hoping. Also, innkeeper of sleight of hand is um, <laughs> quite. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we're gonna make big monsters, right? Yeah. We're gonna make something real. So we're making Carl. <laughs> I'm a big monster. Yeah. I mean. <laughs> uh, <laughs> destroyer of worlds. If this is not big, come on. It's a lot of mana, that's six mana. For a four or five menace, you draw a card, target opponent, whenever you, oh, oh okay. whenever you draw a card, target opponent, mill street cards. It's not yourself, which is good in reanimator. No, I wanted to mill myself so I can reanimate. Is okay. that what I look like, Tolaj? I haven't looked at myself in the mirror today. He's got a mustache. <laughs> okay, I need some more goblins. Uh, Squee. It's a goblin. 100% mm. of the cards with Squee in their name have been goblins. So Squee, aggressive, pile driver. Oh, all the goblin keywords. I wonder if you in the end don't get any playable goblins. <laughs> what are you going to do? <laughs> You're going to try too hard. Tap him. Make him a wizard. <laughs> <laughs> the last time that, that's blue. Oh. It's a wizard. Squee, drug. <laughs> it is a wizard. You shouldn't have said that. I think. Uh. 
I think your. Uh, I think my plan is not working so well. It's not easy to just conjure goblins. The, the, the neural network connection between Tsui and Goblin is maybe not too too strong. Okay, it's your go. Make some more reanimator shenanigans. I think I'm gonna go for one one more big creature. We we need to gang. So we go. Oh, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> of course you would! That sounds big and bad. And we're cool the big and bad. Queen of the big and bad. <laughs> Alright. And we're cool queen of the big and bad. It sounds like a child named it. Yeah. That's not so far from the truth. <laughs> Wait, does we it say- We don't know the mana cost because you have too much text! It's either 4 or 40,000. <laughs> <laughs> and we're cool queen of the big and bad. When Emmer cool queen of the big and bad enters the battlefield, you have a you become a monarch! Emmer cool big and bad and bad's power and toughness are each equal to the total life you've lost this turn. This is, this is not as good. Also, a vampire shaman. <laughs> when is Emrakul? It looks like Emrakul, though. Um, I'm gonna go with Goblin this time. Goblin Master Chief. Maybe you should go, yeah, you can do that. Maybe you should go like a Goblin Goblin. So you, you're oh. very sure. Next card is Goblin Goblin. <laughs> Just two next. It's red. Goblin Master Chief. When Goblin Master Chief enters the battlefield, destroy target artifact. Okay. That's a real card. That's actually pretty good. All right. It's your turn. Mm. So now we have to lose life somehow. You have to lose life, mill yourself, and bring it. Your, your plan is a little risky so far. I, I also kind of need to not die. <laughs> to <do> it, not <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, demonic Pact, and see what it actually gives us. <laughs> That's a real card, That's though. That's a real card, I know. It's black. Instant, as an additional cast, cast a spell, sacrifice a creature, draw two cards. That actually exists. That is a real card. So this doesn't do anything I want to do. No. It's not bad. It's an instant speed draw two cards if like your creature chump blocks. Uh, okay. All right. Dodge? Yes. It's time. It's time for the goblin. Goblin, goblin. goblin. <laughs> We're doing this. If this is not the most goblin spell, <laughs> it has we to have... be the gobliniest goblin. It's a goblin. Two mana, one one. When goblin goblin dies, <laughs> deals two damage to each creature. <laughs> That's not what I want. <laughs> that kills my goblin. But <laughs> oh, goblins just love their kites. <laughs> Thank you. But. You have the thing whenever something a goblin dies, you draw a card, wasn't it like this? Yes, so I draw my you whole just, deck. <laughs> then you, can, you can make more goblins that die. Let's do... Uh, looter Researcher. Yeah, so we want to have something that puts into Graveyard and maybe fix some And loss. Looter? Yeah, like and maybe a cheap looter. creature would be really good. Okay, it's blue, it's a creature, it's three mana, whenever looter researcher deals combat damage to player, draw a card. I mean, that also exists. Um, knowledge is contagious, why not spread it among your friends? Wow, ah, that's very sweet. Deep. Okay, let's try the goblin -iest goblin things again. Goblin? Should I, should I try for mob machine? Mm. It's an artifact. Goblin Artificer, one mana, two, two, and goblin machine enters the battlefield, sacrifice unless you discard a card. I want that, <laughs> I want that. Actually, this is not bad. Okay. It's a one mana two two. I have a one drop. Mhm. Mm okay, you're gonna have to beat my goblin mob machine. I will. I I already know what I'm doing. You have an idea what I'm doing? No. All right. Are you gonna write goblin mob machine? <laughs> yes, I want that card. <laughs> mob. I mean, it, I don't think it gives the same thing. It's one way to find out. One way to find out. No! no! My machine! Oh. <laughs> Sacrifice goblin, mob, put a plus one, plus one counter on target creature. Wait, I don't even have a goblin! <laughs> now I have to make a goblin! <laughs> no! Oh, the thing is disappears, bad. it carries with it a year of knowledge. You baited me into doing this. <laughs> no, that was your own decision, Dolph. <laughs> I don't want this card, so I'm not trying goblin, mob machine again. I'm gonna do... Boss goblin... What's another goblin-y word? Boss Goblin Baker, here we go. This makes food tokens. When Boss Goblin Baker enters the battlefield, create a 1-1 one, one red goblin creature token with haze. Mm -hmm. Two two. It's four mana though, that's not great. Muxus is a big boss goblin. Ah, uh, Muxus is a really good name. All right, I'll go back to make big stuff I like. And that's why we have- Karn? No, no, no. Umag? Legacy. I mean, that sounds bad. You just named the format? Devour Legacy. I'm not even sure that is grammatically correct. But I don't think it makes any sense. There's no card with legacy on the earth. I think it need to be Devourer's Legacy or something. It's blue. Ulamog Devourer Legacy. This spell costs one less to cast for each artifact you control. You called it Legacy. Flying Haste 4-4. Four, four. 
that's probably the best creature we have so far. I mean, I, I guess I'm going elephant serpent. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great creature type. Um, I guess I'm going like big blue flyers. Also, artifacts is not that good if you have like a two minute thing that it destroys art. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <gasps> oh no, I know what I'm doing. All right. Oh, Carl, you're in big trouble. I'm in tr What are you doing? You're in big trouble. Okay, I guess I'll have to wait and find out. As I make a Muxus goblin fast. He's like a quick goblin? He's <laughs> really fast. <laughs> two mana. Goblin, sacrifice Muxus Go- I mean, deals two damage to any target. I, that's not bad, that's not bad, it's a- uh... Muck Fanatic, basically, as a 2-2. Okay, let's see what you got. All right. We're gonna, because we need artifacts, right? <laughs> but we need the artifacts to not die. So, we're gonna go with Dark Steel. <laughs> so very clever. Let's see if it has Indestructible. I mean, it needs to have Indestructible. Every card with Dark Steel, so far, has been Indestructible. No. It's a dinosaur, it's white. It's a flying 2-3, sacrifice another creature, you gain life equal to the sacrifice creature's toughness. Why is this white? Oh wow, this is useless. <laughs> this guy, this, you just wasted your pick. Okay, we're, we're over the halfway mark. I'm just gonna make, keep on making goblins. Goblin boss grenade. This is, can't fail. <laughs> you can't fail. It's a fail safe, in a fail safe. It's one mana, one one, when goblin boss grenade into the battlefield, create a one one goblin creature token with haste. This is so good, you upgrade it. <laughs> You gotta step up your game. I'm gonna, okay. I'm gonna take Engineered Plague. Oh no. Okay, that's a real card, I but. Know. Wait, let's hope we get close <laughs> to what it does. It's black. Whenever Engineered Plague deals damage to a player, put a plus one plus one counter on Engineered Plague. It's hard to. <laughs> it's hard to. It's, hard to. it's not easy flying. Mm. Um, I mean, it's. I still slow. don't have anything that discards. Um, okay, I think I, I need burn spells now. I'm gonna go for... Oh god, no, 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 no. Lightning... Fire... Explosion. Oh, maybe explosion's too big. It's gonna up the mana cost. 12, 12 mana, deal 4 damage. <laughs> oh, 3 mana. Lightning... Elemental... Elements... Elements... What? Nice. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> lightning, <laughs> elemental, <laughs> lightning Elemental Elements Elements. I can't use this dodge! Lightning Elemental Elements Elements. <laughs> it doesn't do anything. Very good. If I need a prowess trigger. Alright, we're gonna do Mass Control Goblin. It's an artifact. Why is it an artifact? Artifact creature golem 2-2, two, two, sacrifice artist creatures you control get plus one plus one until end of turn. Stop making bad cards! How is this any of this? <laughs> I don't know. It's not because even a goblin. it's a mass. If anybody's ever concerned that the AI is taking the world over, <laughs> I don't think they are. Fireball. Flame. Fireball. From Fireball. Side. Flame. Yeah, but that's. Not, are you want like something cheap? Fireball. Flame. Fire. Okay, you're just you're just hitting all the. Oh wait, what's it? Burning spear. Fireball. Fla Fireball. Flame burn. <laughs> that's gonna hurt. One. Ooh, uh, only creatures. But Fireball Flame Burn is a one mana instant. Fireball Flame Burn deals three damage to target creature. Okay. I'm, I'm you gotta step up your game and make things with more than three toughness. Yeah. Four toughness, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Would you think a four toughness dude gives me an actual four toughness creature? There's one way to find out. Okay. We, we go. I mean, this is a wasted shot. I, but this is a shot in the dark, yes. Please. Maybe it'll give you four dudes that are tough. Four toughness, dude. It's, it's got one toughness. Whenever another creature dies, put a plus one, plus one counter on target creature. Actually, that's not bad. Oh, look at the picture. It's it's two toughness, dudes. It's white, and it's oh god. <laughs> I can walk a thousand miles in a month. And I can walk <laughs> a thousand <laughs> miles in a month. <laughs> oh oh oh. <laughs> okay. Tell me if your deck is falling apart. No, I, I had such a good start. You did. I have my burn spell. I have my goblins. I want to land. Goblin lair, land. lair of the goblins. Goblin lair land. No, there's no car. There's no lands called land. No, I'll call it lair land. Yeah, I mean, you need to make it a land, right? Otherwise, goblin lair is like a maybe an enchantment. It's a land. Goblin land enters the battlefield tapped. Oh, I. Mm -hmm. Do you have something green? <laughs> the, the flavor text is it kills him. From Gerda. 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 That's a goblin name. It's a pretty land. There's like the gate watch around a big potato goblin. Oh, that's you. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna. Okay, we're gonna go with Karn. Of course, you're going with Karn. Pacifist. 
What? Two mana, two, two. When Karn Pacifist deals damage to a player, exile the top card of that player's library face down. You may look at that card for as long as it remains exiled and you may play it without paying its mana cost. I guess I'm white. This is Ragavan. <laughs> this is better than Ragavan. I'm gonna go with Hasty Goblin. Uh, Hasty Goblin Lord. Let's make them all kings. When it. It's another one drop though. Mm. Whenever Hasty Goblin Lord attacks, it gets plus one plus zero until end of turn. How could you make him so easy to catch, Goblin? He can't even get up in the middle of the day. That, yeah, that's, that's, I'm in this picture and I don't like it. <laughs> I'm in this picture and I don't like it. Sphere of protection. Okay, your, your reanimator stuff didn't work. You're going. No, not at all. Enchantment creature sphere. Yeah! All creatures have protection for you. Yeah! No! Let's no! make some spheres. <laughs> oh, this is so good against me. I love it. Oh no. Oh, this is super strong against me. Okay, gotta make a green creature. Goblin questing beast. <laughs> but will that be green? I need something that's green. What did it say if you make like green goblin? It won't be green. Why not? It's, it literally says green. Green goblin. Okay, you got me, Ralph. It won't be green, I tell you. This is a bait. It's too late, I clicked. <laughs> it's a bait. <laughs> it's not green. It's a 1-1 one, one flying from, I get so many good one drops. It, if I sacrifice it, it deals one damage to a new target. This is not bad. No. If you get a Goblin Lord, I'm so screwed. Yeah, I've got one shot though. Am I going for a green creature or Goblin Lord? Because you have one card that hoses down all my cards. One, you say, huh? Are you going to write the same to... Sphere <laughs> Detection Goblin? Let's go, we need more spheres. <laughs> oh yeah, because... Wait, is there Sphere Tribal? Is it it said Spheres gain protection from Rath. Ah, I thought all creatures. No, what? Even Soldier, whenever Spear of Protection Goblins attacks, you may exile target creature card from a graveyard. If you do, you gain life equal to that card's toughness. Okay, okay, okay. That's not bad. That's not bad. It's my last card. Gotta make a green. Or a lord. I'm gonna try to go for Goblin Lord. Ah, uh, you mean like, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I mean, it's a 1-1. One, one. It blocks, you know. Goblin, boss, war chief, mob. It's... Boss Warchief Mob Goblin <laughs> attacks each combat if able. Whenever Boss Warchief Mob Goblin deals combat damage to a player, exile the top card of that player's library face down. You may look at that card if for as long as it remains exiled. No! I thought it was gonna end like your card. No, you can just look at it, you know? Just enjoy <laughs> looking at it. It's like, ooh. I'm disappointed, Toralf. Okay, last go. I want to make another sphere. How, how, what is the highest chance of making a sphere? Call it sphere? Sphere, maybe protecting sphere. Yeah, we're gonna you know, we, we, we're gonna survive protecting sphere. Are you ready to shoot your shot? Last one. Give me something that has protection. It's a three mana instant. Sphere deals one damage to target creature. Scry one. Look at the top card of your library. You may put the card on the bottom of your library. Why is this? <laughs> this is a three mana one damage burn spell. It's an instant. Why isn't it one? Okay, Tola. Yes. Let's go make some decks. Let's do it. So are you ready to play with some really bad cards? I'm <laughs> excellent. I'm not sure how this goes. Your card is actually super powerful. Well, uh, would you like to high roll or do you have some AI version of high rolling? What is an AI version of high rolling? I mean... <laughs> I got eight. an eight. No. That's not eight. All right, so you start? Yeah, I would oh, like to go first. That's dangerous. I want to draw a lot of tolls. Uh, you know what, Don? I can keep this. All right, hit me. Um, I'm gonna play. I, I, I didn't actually mean hit. Me. <laughs> yeah, but I'm gonna play a goblin mob machine. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and to the battlefield, I sacrifice it unless I discard a card, which I will hastily do. Wait, this is not even red. Oh, you have the, the protection red. from red card. Well, no, but uh, um, soon. I, I, I'm still gonna have to discard a card. I will discard I mean, this. It can't be that hard in your deck. Mountain, go. It can't be that hard to discard a card in my deck. Are you implying my cards are bad? Yes. No, I like not implying, like actually saying. <laughs> so, well, so, Mr. I play a 1-1 one, one for 1 that sacrifices and puts a plus 1 plus it 1 counter. It puts a counter. All right. Go ahead. I'll drop. It's an artifact, right? Uh, no. I'll play... No, 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 no. It's, it's not an artifact. It's not an artifact. Goblin Master Chief. Um, it's uh, when he enters the battlefield, he's trying to get artifact. <laughs> Synergies! I'll take it for two. 18. Go ahead. Terrible. 
Let's play a four toughness dude. How much toughness is your four toughness dude guy have? One. Go. Um, I'll untap. I'll drift return. This is gonna feel awkward. It's gonna kind of feel like looking in fr into a mirror. But I'm gonna play a Tarat Potato Goblin. Hmm. Uh, so it's a 2 2 whenever another creature I control dies. If I control another goblin, I draw a card. Do you control a goblin? Do you? I do. Yeah. Uh, I control two, actually. I'm going to swing for four. Sick. I, I curved a one drop into a two drop that killed your creature into a lord that makes me draw cards every time my creatures die. All right. Oh, that blocks for days. Go. Um, so when this dies, it puts a plus one plus one counter. When anything dies that's not him, he gets a counter. Oh, that's super annoying, actually. Um, still, if I attack with everything, you're forced to take two. I'm going to attack with these two. I'm going to block one, take two. Twelve. Twelve. And... I'll play the most disappointing boss war chief mob goblin. He attacks every turn if able. And whenever boss war chief mob goblin deals combat damage to player, exile the top card of that player's library face down. You may look at it. Yeah. As long as it remains exiled. All right, we'll play dark steel sum. Ooh. Go. Uh, yeah, that, that, that's, a, that's a dinosaur, right? That's a dinosaur. Sacrifice the another creature. amazing. You gain, oh, if you sacrifice, you can pump this and gain life. This I is know. a combo. I mean, I built this myself. I'll draw. I will play a Goblin Boss Grenade. Mm -hmm. You got a token. When it enters the battlefield, I make a Tokov token. I got some prepared. Um, Wait, you made tokens? <laughs> Dude, this does not look like you. It's eating a potato. Mm, I like potatoes. <laughs> yeah, you do. That's why, that's why you're potato, to a goblin, uh, to a potato Goblin. Um, now that has haste. Like three and a half? I think I'll attack like this. Mm -hmm. Uh, we'll block. Uh, like this. Okay. Um, oh, because this is not red. Also, I mean, this has to attack next turn. Yeah, you'll take four. I'll draw one for Tolat Potato Goblin. Yes. I will draw one for this dine from Tolat Potato Goblin. Yes. I'll play land. Also, yes. And... Pass the turn. All right. Let's attack for two. I'll take two. And 18. Then play a, another Dark Steel Sun. Oh my god. Go ahead. I'll untap, I'll draw. I mean, dinosaurs come in pairs, you know? Um, you know what also comes in pairs? Oh god, no. It's not legendary. Oh. I'll play a second Toralf, Potato Goblin. I'll attack with my boss, War Chief Goblin, ma Mob Goblin. Yeah. Uh, ooh, actually. I'm gonna block. I know, that's the I was hoping you wouldn't do that. I'll uh, pass the turn to you. Yes. Yes. Ooh. All right, my friend. <gasps> no, is that? It's Ula Ulamog. Ulamog. Uh, Ulamog Devour Legacy. It sounds like someone Google searched a deck. Uh, this spell costs one less to cast for each artifact you control, which you have none. Yeah. Uh, it's fl Flying Haste 4-4. Four, four. Oh my, you have eight power of flying on the board. That's good, that's good. So you're my 18, goblins. Right? I'm at 18, yes. All right, let's hit you for six. I go to I go to 12. Go ahead. I need to draw my... Um, I need to draw my burn spells. I'm going to make another potato goblin. I made another one. This one's holding a bag of potatoes. Oh, that's more like me. <laughs> it is more like you. Um, I'm going to attack with the lot. Okay, this time you say I have to kill stuff, huh? huh? I'm not attacking with the tall elves. Tall elves to save for now. All right. Um, I'm an eight, huh? So this one goes here. Yeah, this is good. All right. Okay, you take two? I'll take two. You go to six. six. Uh, this dies, I draw two cards. This dies, I draw two cards. I might deck myself. You might deck yourself. I draw Ooh, two yeah. cards. That snake is huge. I'm gonna kill it. Let's go. Go. All right. Ooh. So you're at 12. Yep, yeah. all right, let's attack uh, like this. I'll block the 7-7? Yes, sir. 
I'll draw two cards and take six damage. I go to six. And then we play another researcher. Oh, that's so annoying. And it's your turn. I will kill one of the researchers with my fireball flame burn. Um, yeah, let's go to nine. That card is so good against me. I am gonna need something huge to get out of this. If you kill this, you can exile a card from my library and look at it. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm gonna play a boss goblin baker. Yes. Comes with a goblin. <laughs> this arm. When his knife is drawn, it would leave a scar in the direction of his chest. That doesn't make any sense. It doesn't. Um, I'll attack with everything. I'm at nine. I'm gonna block. Well, I'll block this one. Okay. Because I don't want to. You take five. Go I, go. You go to four. Yeah. How are you not dying, my friend? I don't have anything else. Mm. My turn? Yes. How many cards do you have in your library? Oh, you wanted to kill this? Well, that's, that's gonna deal one damage to this. <laughs> Let's just see what happens. We each get two, you're at two. I'm at four. Yeah. So oh. this dies and you draw two. Okay, this dies and draw two. Yeah. D doesn't your Emrakul mill? Uh, actually, this do draw because you still have goblins, but then they all die. And then they all check if you have goblins, but you don't have Which them. I don't. Yeah. You just wipe my board for three mana. And did you scry? I didn't scry yet, but also thank you for playing. Like, attacks? Yes. Good games. You got it. Ulamok too strong. Talk, did you have fun? It's a crazy how much agency you have probably over the cards and then how least agency. Like, yeah, like, like we, having a goblin deck, I mean, if you were a bit more lucky, I think you could. If have, I had one goblin lord, yeah. this would have been super strong. Or something like. A four mana that makes you sacrifice guys. Like, yeah, like more than one goblin payoff. Yeah, I think you can you can actually have a lot of training with it. <laughs> you managed to get protection from red card. <laughs> oh, did you do that? Yeah. All right, uh, people listening at home, if you enjoyed it, uh, please comment, subscribe, like, and watch the other. We did another AI generated cards video. If you like that format better than this one where you try to build the deck, uh, let us know in the comments and maybe we'll do something like that. It requires a lot more time. But if you guys like it, then it's worth the payoff. So look at that one. Um, it's gonna show up in a few seconds uh, with the end credits as a linkable video. And if you did enjoy, please subscribe. If you're not subscribed, uh, that's what allows us to do things like get an AI to generate two decks. Um, so we'll thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next one.